Yo, 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 what is going on, guys? If you do not know who I am, my name is Matthew Pachota, and I am with Pachota Construction, and welcome to our YouTube channel. Today was day number two of the addition job. So today I went out and they actually dug the foundation. They dug the, all the foundation all the way around. They poured all the footings and they filled in up levels so that they are able to pour their slab in a couple days or so. They also finished cleaning all the brick. They tore down the rest of the brick and they finished cleaning it all. So here's a video to give you guys an update. Take it away, past Matt. All right, thank you, future Matthew. So I am actually here at the job today. This is about the second, third day of progress. You can see that the excavator is right there behind me. The foundation is all dug and they poured today. So this is the update of what it looks like. And then we also, up there, we actually, all the chimney is all down. We got that all taken care of. We got half of the roof all torn off, as you can see up there. Half the roof is all torn off. All the brick is off the back of the house. The windows and everything are totally gone, as you've seen in the first video. They filled in all this, so this is about a foot, foot and a half higher than the other ground because you had to build it up in order for us to pour our slab when we do it. And as also over here on the inside, you can see this is the this is the heat register vent right here. We we had to cut the cement out so that we are able to run our heat register vent all the way to the back side so we can put it on the back side wall for the addition. And then we also we also ran another gas line, so they have another gas line out there for another fireplace that they're going to end up putting in. And then you can also see on this side over here is that the cement is cut right there too. And there's another heat register vent that is going to run out all the way to this side on the back side wall. And we're going to put it in there. As you also come inside, you can see that now the door wall is all boarded up and everything. All the ceiling, you can't really tell because it's dark now, but all the ceiling is gone. No insulation or anything up there. We also have all the siding up there all stripped off. And then we got the siding on the side over here on the corners. That's all stripped off because the whole roof is going to be coming off. And then over here, we have all the brick that we tore off the back. This is all piled up, all cleaned up, all all the mortar is cleaned up off of it and we got them all stacked up because we're going to be reusing them. So now for the now for the next couple days or so, they're going to be finished tearing off the rest of that all the rest of the roof and we're going to be basically focusing on tearing it down the rest of the way. They're going to add the block, they're going to add uh, two courses of block up there and then they're going to pour the slab and then after that it's going to be basically it's going to be basically tearing it down the rest of the way, ripping the rest of the roof off and uh, basically start building from there. We got all the trusses that are out front, out front of the house that we got to carry back here, so we're going to carry those back here and then we're just going to basically start building from there. So, back to you, future Matt. All right, thank you, Pass Matt, for that live update. Now let me tell you guys something. It was only 5.30 when I shot that video and going to school all day and then coming back and trying to make that video is so hard because Mother Nature, why you gotta do it to us? Why you gotta get dark so early? But anyways, you guys can see that we have made a lot of progress on it. When Pachota Construction comes to a job, I call it the one, two Mayweather because we come in and we get the job done and it, is, it moves very quick and very fast because we know what we're doing and we know how to do it the right way. And I'm, I'm also going to include a couple pictures of the progress, because I went out and took a picture, a couple pictures after I, uh, after I shot that video. So here are those pictures right now.
All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to drop a thumbs up. Make sure you scroll on down and hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment if you guys liked the video. If you guys would like to see something, make sure to leave that comment down below so I can see it. I'll read all the comments. And we'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you liked it.